Hey what's up guys this is Wasi from flamelinevisualeffects.com and welcome back to my another brand new After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial I will show you how to create a simple logo animation in Adobe After Effects so let's see what we will create today. Can I get 500 likes for this tutorial? If yes, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Okay, so let's get started. First create a new composition and then import your logo. And I have divided this logo into two parts. Here is the first one and here is the second one. After that, go to colors.co website. Here you can find a lot of amazing color palettes. Choose one of them. I really like this one then simply click here then click on export then simply import this color palette into your after effects then place it anywhere in your composition like this now let's create a new solid layer rename it to BG and I am going to use this color then click on ok then put it below all the layers then hide this part of the logo now first i am going to animate this part of the logo right click on this layer then click on pre-compose then rename it to logo then select move all attributes then click on ok now select this layer then go to effect and preset window then search for fill then select this effect and apply onto this layer then color set it to white and then select this layer then go to layer and then click on auto trace channel set it alpha and then click on ok now go to effect and preset window and search for stroke then simply select this effect and apply onto this layer then brush hardness set it 100% and then click on all marks and then uncheck this option and then paint style set it reveal original image then increase the brush size something like this then go to beginning of this animation and then set a keyframe on brush size then select this layer then press u then select this keyframe and move it forward few frames then brush size set it zero then select these two keyframe and press f9 to make them easy ease again go to beginning of this animation then start amount set it 100 percent then set a keyframe on it then go forward few seconds maybe two seconds and then start amount set it zero then press u to open keyframes then select these two keyframe then press f9 and then open graph editor and then change the graph crop to something like this perfect looks good to me Now select this layer then press ctrl plus D twice. Then select these first two layers and then move them 7 or 8 frame forward like this. Also do same with the first layer. Now change the color of the last two layers from the color palette. Something like this. looks good to me okay now select this layer and then press ctrl plus d and then remove the stroke effect then change the color from our color palette now select this layer then go to effect and preset window and search for 
radial whip then select this effect and apply onto this layer then whip set it counterclockwise and change the center position something around here now increase the amount of transition completion then set a keyframe on it then go forward few frames and then set it zero now select this layer then press u then select this two keyframe then press f9 and then open graph editor and then change the graph curve to something like this Now select this layer then press ctrl plus D then change the color to white then move the layer few frame forward like this looks good to me now you can delete this color palette Now I am going to animate this second part of this logo. Turn on visibility of this layer. Then go forward few seconds. Then select this layer. Then press P. Then hold down shift. Then press T. Then select this two keyframe and then move the keyframe few frames forward. Then change the position to something like this. and then opacity set it 0 then select all keyframes then press F9 to make them easy ease then select this 2 keyframe then open graph editor and then change the graph crop to something like this Let's adjust the timing a little bit. Perfect. Now create a null object. Then select these layers and parent it to null 1 like this. Now go to around 2 seconds. Then press S to open scale. Then set a keyframe on scale and then amount set it 170 then go forward few frames then scale amount set it 100 then select this two keyframe and press f9 then open graph editor and then change the graph crop to something like this Perfect, looks good to me. Now select these layers, then right click and choose pre-compose and rename it to logo animation. Then select mobile attributes, then click on OK. Now select this layer, then press Ctrl plus D, then select this duplicate layer, then go to effect and preset window and search for fill. Then select this effect and apply onto this layer. Then color, set it black. Then again go to effect and preset window and search for CC radial first blur. Then select this effect and apply onto this layer. Then change the center position something around here. Then change the amount to 90.
Then select this layer, then press T and opacity set it 50%. Let's change the center position. Now it looks good to me. Our animation is complete. Press 0 to ramp view this. Thank you very much for watching this tutorial. Have a great day.